Chapter 1 The Discovery The musty scent of ancient parchment filled Dr. Liam Novak's nostrils as he carefully turned the pages of the fragile manuscript. The dim light of the Vatican archives cast an eerie glow on the yellowed pages, their edges worn and frayed by the passage of time. Liam's heart raced with anticipation, his eyes scanning the cryptic text for any clues that might shed light on the enigmatic legend of the fallen angels. As a renowned archaeologist and linguist, Liam had spent years studying ancient languages and civilizations, seeking to unravel the mysteries of the past. But nothing could have prepared him for the discovery that lay before him now. The manuscript, written in an obscure dialect of Aramaic, hinted at the existence of fallen angels living among humans, their presence woven into the very fabric of history. Liam's mind reeled with the implications of such a revelation. If the manuscript was authentic, it would challenge everything he had ever believed about the nature of reality and the origins of humanity. He knew that he couldn't ignore this discovery, no matter how much it unsettled him. As he delved deeper into the text, Liam's eyes widened in shock. The manuscript spoke of a cosmic battle that had raged for millennia, a struggle between the fallen angels and the forces of heaven. It warned of a coming apocalypse, a final confrontation that would determine the fate of all creation. Liam's hands trembled as he turned the final page, his mind racing with questions. Who had written this manuscript, and why had it been hidden away in the depths of the Vatican archives? What secrets did it hold, and what would be the consequences of revealing them to the world? He knew that he couldn't keep this discovery to himself. He had to find out the truth, no matter the cost. With a sense of determination, Liam carefully tucked the manuscript into his satchel and made his way out of the archives, his footsteps echoing in the cavernous halls. As he stepped out into the bright sunlight of Rome, Liam felt a sense of purpose that he had never known before. He knew that his journey was just beginning and that the road ahead would be fraught with danger and uncertainty. But he was ready to face whatever challenges lay ahead, armed with the knowledge that he had uncovered and the conviction that the truth must be brought to light. Little did Liam know that his actions had already set in motion a chain of events that would change the course of history forever. Forces beyond his comprehension were at work, and he would soon find himself at the center of a cosmic struggle that would test the limits of his faith and his courage. But for now, all he could do was take the first step on a journey that would lead him to the very edges of the universe and beyond. Chapter 2 The Encounter The crisp mountain air filled Liam's lungs as he trekked through the rugged Himalayan terrain. The path to the remote monastery was treacherous, but Liam's determination to uncover the truth behind the fallen angels drove him forward. With each step, he felt as if he were drawing closer to a destiny he had never imagined. As the sun began to set, Liam caught sight of the monastery, its ancient stone walls seeming to grow out of the mountainside. Exhausted but exhilarated, he approached the heavy wooden doors and knocked the sound echoing through the stillness of the evening. The door creaked open, revealing a figure cloaked in shadows. As the figure stepped into the light, Liam found himself face to face with Sister Sophia, a woman whose piercing blue eyes seemed to hold the wisdom of the ages. Welcome, Dr. Novak, she said, her voice soft yet commanding. We have been expecting you. Liam's heart raced as he followed Sister Sophia into the monastery, the flickering candlelight casting an otherworldly glow on the stone walls. As they walked, Sister Sophia revealed that she had been studying the legend of the fallen angels for years and that she believed Liam's discovery of the manuscript was no coincidence. The fallen angels have been waiting for someone like you, Dr. Novak, she said her eyes gleaming with a mysterious intensity, someone with the knowledge and the courage to uncover the truth. As they entered the monastery's library, Liam's eyes widened in wonder. The shelves were lined with ancient texts and artifacts, each one holding a piece of the puzzle he had been searching for. 
Sister Sophia led him to a large wooden table where she carefully laid out the manuscript he had brought with him. Together, they pored over the cryptic text, their minds working in unison to decipher its secrets. Hours turned into days as they worked tirelessly, fueled by a shared passion for the truth. And as they delved deeper into the mystery, Liam began to realize that the fallen angels were more than just a legend. They were a reality that had been hidden from humanity for centuries. But, with each new revelation, came a growing sense of unease. Liam couldn't shake the feeling that they were being watched, that someone or something was trying to stop them from uncovering the truth. And as he looked into Sister Sophia's eyes, he saw a flicker of fear that mirrored his own. We must be careful, Dr. Novak, she whispered, her voice trembling slightly. The forces that seek to keep this knowledge hidden are powerful and ruthless. We cannot let them stop us. Liam nodded, his resolve stronger than ever. He knew that the path ahead would be dangerous, but he was ready to face whatever challenges lay ahead. With Sister Sophia by his side, he felt as if he could take on the world. As they stepped out of the library and into the cool mountain air, Liam couldn't help but feel a sense of awe at the incredible journey he had embarked upon. He knew that the truth about the fallen angels would change everything, and he was determined to see it through to the end, no matter the cost. Chapter 3. The Revelation Liam and Sophia sat huddled over the ancient manuscript, their minds racing with the implications of what they had discovered. The text spoke of a great war that had raged in the heavens eons ago, a battle between the loyal angels and those who had rebelled against their creator. The fallen angels, cast out of heaven, had been condemned to walk the earth for eternity, their powers diminished, but their influence still felt in the hearts of mankind. As they delved deeper into the manuscript, Liam and Sophia began to uncover a shocking truth. The fallen angels were not merely mythical beings, but had been actively shaping the course of human history for millennia. From the rise and fall of great empires to the most pivotal moments in art, science, and religion, the fingerprints of the fallen ones could be seen everywhere. But the manuscript also hinted at a darker purpose behind the angels' actions. It spoke of a coming apocalypse, a final battle between the forces of good and evil that would determine the fate of all creation. And at the center of this cosmic struggle were the fallen angels themselves, who had been preparing for this moment since the dawn of time. Liam felt a chill run down his spine as he realized the enormity of what they had uncovered. If the manuscript was true, then the entire course of human history had been nothing more than a prelude to this final confrontation. And he and Sophia were now a part of it, whether they liked it or not. As they pored over the final pages of the manuscript, Liam's mind reeled with questions. Who were these fallen angels, and what did they want? How had they managed to keep their existence hidden for so long? And most importantly, what role did he and Sophia have to play in the coming battle? Sophia, sensing Liam's unease, placed a comforting hand on his shoulder. We cannot turn back now, she said softly. The truth has been revealed to us for a reason. We must see this through to the end no matter what the cost. Liam nodded, his resolve hardening. He knew that the path ahead would be fraught with danger and uncertainty, but he also knew that he could not ignore the truth that had been placed before him. He had to find out more to uncover the secrets of the fallen angels and their place in the grand scheme of things. As they stepped out of the library and into the cool mountain air, Liam felt a sense of purpose that he had never known before. He knew that he was no longer just a scholar, but a warrior in a battle that had been raging since the beginning of time. And with Sophia by his side, he felt ready to face whatever challenges lay ahead. Little did they know, however, that their actions had already set in motion a chain of events that would lead them to the very heart of the mystery. Forces beyond their control were converging and the fate of the world hung in the balance.
The revelation of the fallen angels was only the beginning, and Liam and Sophia would soon find themselves at the center of a cosmic struggle that would test the limits of their faith, their courage, and their love for each other. Chapter 4. The Betrayal As Liam and Sophia continued their investigation into the fallen angels, they soon realized that they were not alone in their pursuit of the truth. A powerful secret society, known only as the Order of the Watchful Eye, had been monitoring their every move, determined to keep the existence of the fallen ones hidden from the world at any cost. At first, the Order approached Liam and Sophia with offers of assistance, claiming to have access to ancient texts and artifacts that could help them in their quest. Grateful for any help they could get, the two accepted the Order's aid, unaware of the danger that lurked beneath the surface. As they delved deeper into the mystery, however, Liam began to notice inconsistencies in the Order's story. Certain documents seemed to contradict each other, and the Order's representatives grew increasingly evasive when pressed for answers. It wasn't long before Liam realized the terrible truth. The Order was not there to help them, but to sabotage their efforts and keep the truth buried forever. Betrayed and on the run, Liam and Sophia found themselves in a desperate race against time to uncover the secrets of the fallen angels before the Order could stop them. They knew that they could trust no one but each other, and that every moment brought them closer to the final confrontation that would decide the fate of the world. As they fled through the winding streets of ancient cities and across the windswept plains of forgotten lands, Liam and Sophia found themselves drawn closer together by the shared danger they faced. They knew that they were fighting not just for the truth, but for each other, and that their love was the one thing that could see them through the darkness ahead. But even as they pushed forward, the order was closing in, their agents determined to stop them at any cost. Liam and Sophia knew that they were running out of time, and that they would have to risk everything if they were to have any hope of uncovering the truth and stopping the Order's plans. In a final, desperate gamble, they decided to confront the Order head-on, to force them to reveal the secrets they had been hiding for so long. They knew that it was a risky move, but they also knew that they had no choice. The fate of the world hung in the balance, and they were the only ones who could stop the coming apocalypse. As they prepared for the final showdown, Liam and Sophia knew that they were facing the greatest challenge of their lives. But they also knew that they had each other, and that their love was stronger than any force the Order could bring to bear against them. With a sense of grim determination, they set out to face their destiny, ready to risk everything for the chance to uncover the truth and save the world from the machinations of the fallen angels and their human allies. The betrayal had only made them stronger, and they knew that nothing could stop them now. The final battle was about to begin, and the fate of all creation hung in the balance. Chapter 5. The Confrontation The wind whipped through Liam's hair as he and Sophia raced towards the ancient ruins where the Order of the Watchful Eye had hidden the final pieces of the puzzle. They knew that they were walking into a trap, but they also knew that they had no choice. The fate of the world depended on their success, and they were determined to see their mission through to the end. As they approached the crumbling stone walls of the ruins, Liam and Sophia could sense the presence of the fallen angels all around them. The air crackled with an otherworldly energy, and the shadows seemed to writhe and twist with a life of their own. They knew that they were on the threshold of a cosmic battle that had been brewing for millennia, and that they were the only ones who could stop it. With a final, desperate push, they breached the defenses of the Order and found themselves face to face with the fallen angels themselves. The beings were at once terrifying and beautiful, their forms shifting and changing like smoke on the wind. Liam and Sophia knew that they were outmatched in terms of sheer power, but they also knew that they had something the angels did not, the strength of their love and the courage of their convictions. As the battle raged around them, Liam and Sophia fought with everything they had, their weapons and their wits the only things standing between them and oblivion. They dodged and weaved through the chaos, 
their hearts pounding in their chests as they struggled to stay one step ahead of their enemies. But even as they fought, Liam could feel a strange sense of calm washing over him. He had always been a man of reason and logic, but in that moment, he realized that there were forces at work beyond his understanding. He could feel the weight of destiny on his shoulders, and he knew that he had been chosen for this moment, this battle, this chance to make a difference. With a final desperate effort, Liam launched himself at the leader of the fallen angels, his sword flashing in the dim light of the ruins. The two clashed in a shower of sparks and a clang of metal on metal, their wills locked in a battle as old as time itself. In that moment, Liam realized what he had to do. He knew that he could not defeat the angel on his own, but he also knew that he could buy Sophia the time she needed to complete their mission. With a final, anguished cry, he threw himself at the angel, his sword piercing the being's chest, even as he felt the cold embrace of death closing in around him. As he fell to the ground, his life ebbing away, Liam could see Sophia standing over him, tears streaming down her face. He knew that he had made the ultimate sacrifice, but he also knew that it had been worth it. With his last breath, he whispered the words that had been burning in his heart since the moment he first laid eyes on her. I love you. And then, with a final sigh, Liam closed his eyes and surrendered himself to the darkness, knowing that he had played his part in the great cosmic drama that had been unfolding around them. The confrontation was over, but the battle was far from finished. It was up to Sophia now to carry on the fight to use the knowledge they had uncovered to save the world from the machinations of the fallen angels. And in that moment, Liam knew that she would not fail. Chapter 6 The Redemption The world seemed to hold its breath in the aftermath of the battle, as if the very fabric of reality had been torn asunder by the clash between the fallen angels and the two brave souls who had dared to stand against them. Sophia knelt beside Liam's still form, her heart shattered into a million pieces by the sacrifice he had made for her, for the world, for the truth. But even as she wept, Sophia knew that she could not let Liam's death be in vain. With a fierce determination burning in her heart, she gathered up the ancient texts and artifacts they had uncovered, the keys to unlocking the secrets of the fallen angels and their place in the grand scheme of things. For months, she traveled the world, speaking to anyone who would listen about the truth she had uncovered. She faced skepticism and ridicule at every turn, but she never wavered in her conviction. She knew that the world needed to know the truth, no matter how painful or frightening it might be. And slowly, as the weight of the evidence began to mount, people started to listen. Scholars and scientists from all over the globe flocked to Sophia's side, eager to help her unravel the mysteries of the fallen angels and their role in shaping the course of human history. Together, they pored over the ancient texts, piecing together the fragments of a story that had been hidden for millennia. They discovered that the fallen angels were not the embodiment of evil that the Order had made them out to be, but rather tragic figures who had been caught up in a cosmic struggle beyond their control. In the end, it was Liam's sacrifice that had made the difference. By giving his life to save Sophia and the world, he had shown the fallen angels that humanity was capable of great courage and selflessness, even in the face of overwhelming odds. And in that moment, something had changed within them. As Sophia and her team continued their work, they began to notice strange occurrences all around them people who had once been consumed by greed and selfishness began to show signs of compassion and kindness. Wars that had raged for generations came to a sudden and inexplicable end. It was as if the world itself was being reborn, transformed by the power of the truth that had been unleashed. And at the center of it all was Sophia, the woman who had loved and lost who had struggled and sacrificed, who had dared to stand against the darkness and emerge victorious. She knew that Liam was gone, but she also knew that he would always be with her, 
guiding her from beyond the veil of death. As she stood on the threshold of a new era, Sophia knew that the journey was far from over. There were still secrets to be uncovered, still battles to be fought. But she also knew that she was not alone. She had the strength of Liam's love, the wisdom of the ages, and the courage of her own convictions to guide her. And so, with a heart full of hope and a soul full of purpose, Sophia stepped forward into the unknown, ready to embrace whatever challenges lay ahead. She knew that the fallen angels had been redeemed, that humanity had been given a second chance, and she knew that no matter what the future might hold, she would never stop fighting for the truth, for the memory of the man she had loved, and for the world that he had died to save.